So uh, then we were all at the Seattle JCL convention in 1988. Uh, and uh, we got word that tomorrow morning, the president's going to sign the bill. He's going to sign the bill? And we're all sitting in Seattle. So everyone makes airplane reservations, and we call the White House and said, hey, he can't just sign the bill. This has to be a public ceremony. And we'll all fly out, and we'll get everyone there. So they said, okay, we'll make it a signing ceremony. And they said, we'll do it at, I don't know, 11 o'clock in the morning. So everyone was flying, just racing around, trying to get reservations on the airplane to get from Seattle, Washington, to Washington, D.C. Everyone was on the red eye. And we all get to the White House, we're all bleary-eyed, and we're all there watching the ceremony uh, on them. President Reagan signed the bill. There's a picture of uh, President signing the bill. And uh, so I was saying to, uh, to Pat Psyche, I said, hey, Pat, look at that signature there. And because that was my signature on the bill as Speaker Pro Tem on what they call the red line copy of the bill that the president signs because it was Sparky Matsunaga as uh, uh, speaker, I mean, as president pro tem of the U.S. Senate, me as speaker pro tem of the U.S. House, and then President Reagan with him signing the bill. And, uh, you know, I thought, where else but only in a country like, like the United States could this, something like this happen?